Hey guys, um, so lately I've been struggling to wake up on time, so my alarm always goes off at 7, and pretty much every morning I hit the snooze until like 10 past 7, quarter past 7, kind of around that time, and even though every time in the evening I tell myself, this time you're gonna wake up at 7, I still hit the snooze. And I think one of the things, I mean, now it's light outside, but right now it's winter, so at seven, it's always fucking dark. And I hate waking up in the dark. Um, so yeah, I, don't, uh, I haven't decided yet what I'm gonna do. I think tomorrow I'm gonna try to wake up at eight and just shift my schedule and wake up in the light again. I just want light. Okay, I have a question, and I need you guys to be um, honest with me. Have I been getting too serious lately? Because, I mean, most of you guys know me from, well, from before the vlog, from Instagram, and, I mean, <laughs> you know, you know me longer than just one or two months. Have I been getting too serious and, you know, forgetting, forgetting to, you know, be goofy and weird and all of that stuff, because I feel like, not that I have forgotten it, but I think what creeped in was thinking that, you know, if you're running a business and you're doing all of this, like, entrepreneurship, like, you can't be goofy and weird and and a kid anymore, you know, you need to be serious. And I do think there's a balance. I fucking hate the word balance. But I do think that, you know, when you're focusing and when you're working, you're working. Then you're not funny. Like, you're not always funny. You're not always goofy. When you're getting shit done, you're getting shit done. But that doesn't mean that, you know, in between or after that or before that or, you know, while I'm doing like a weird story that I then can't be, you know, weird and goofy. Have I been doing that? Let me know. I don't know. Maybe I've been, I mean, <laughs> maybe a little bit. I've definitely gotten way more concentrated and focused and have gotten way more shit done than I used to get done back in New York because I was so focused on the social media thing and I was like spending so much time on Instagram that nothing else beside that happened. But um, yeah, maybe I should bring it back a little bit. Let me know. <laughs> Let me know. So um, I just got vaccinated for, for my Bali trip. I got two vaccinations, I think, for typhus and... Um, what was the other one? Japanese encephalitis or something. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck. Um, and, I, and I forgot to, to vlog it. Um, I actually filmed it on my Instagram, but um, now my arm hurts. Cra crazy. That's just craziness. My arm hurts. But I got told I can't work out today. Today's handball training and have it twice a week. And now I can't go. At least what that's what she said. It was a doctor. Um, but yeah, that's just what happened, you know. I got vaccinated. It was exciting. You missed out. It was super fun. It wasn't actually as bad as I thought it was. And I thought I would get, like, headaches and stuff. I got a little bit of a headache. And my arm hurts that I can't can hardly move it but that's about it ah groceries i also just put in my um my bank account that i found so now i'm a thousand euros richer well not actually i already had that but now it's on my other account so that's nice Ja, ich habe ausgemacht. Wirklich, ich, ich filme nicht mehr. Ja, ja. <lacht> hey, um, it's me again. Um, it's mostly me, but um, I just wanted to make sure the thing that I talked about yesterday, whether I'm actually doing it, and I'm not sure if I did it today, um, but I want to make sure that I remind myself constantly. So if you still have any ideas how we can make this more interactive, because I want to make this be about growing together 
and not just me be me talking about me because well that's kind of boring but also i think it would be cool if we if we all work together on ourselves so yeah that's that's still a thing you know that we should be doing uh -huh. yeah i don't i don't have any other question besides if you didn't watch yesterday's vlog do you like that idea? Maybe check out yesterday's vlog. And what form should this take? Got any ideas? So I just hopped off a call with um, Brandon and Tommy, two good friends of mine who I met in New York and they are both building out an agency and helping out people with Instagram uh, management with, um, with ads and some YouTube growth I think and so we're we're we started talking about combining efforts or at least cross promoting kind of um our clients where there's overlap and in, in, you know client needs and, and services because we're doing LinkedIn um they're doing other social media platforms so there might be potential to work together um just had a call with my sister who is in Italy right now and is going on a trip to Neapel, I think, over the weekend, which I'm fucking jealous about. Um, and now it's 10.30, and I have a call in one hour, um, which is not usual, but um, that guy is in Australia, and that was his only time he was able to talk, so I'm going to stay up for an hour and then have another call. Um, and I thought that would be the perfect time to also... I think yesterday I talked about wanting to sleep until the sun is out so i'm gonna use that shift in and schedule to sleep to 8 a.m tomorrow and hopefully wake up to light outside but that means i'm gonna sign off now thank you so much for watching um i mean i know i already signed off but i'm pretty sure i just closed the client remember that i think last week or two weeks ago i i talked about the whale that i was talking to and that I was overpricing and that he kind of taught me a lesson while on the call. I, I, and, that, and that he said that he wants me to send him an offer that he can't refuse. Well, apparently I did that. Um, so now I have him as a client for LinkedIn management for 2,000 euros a month plus, plus 1,500 per sale that i'm generating for his um for his service which is still even though i went down with the price and now it's more performance based still by far not by far no but i'm still my highest paying paying client now i mean he hasn't signed yet but i just sent him a whatsapp saying did you read my my email because I haven't gotten a reply and he just told me one thing he wants to change or said something one thing that he didn't quite like and so I asked can I send over a contract and he said yeah and sending over a contract is pretty much that usually says means yes so I think we just close a new client that's not too bad to end off the day well I still have one call still have that one call but um that's good news I'm, I'm not sure I'm gonna survive that call but um now we're gonna say goodbye see you tomorrow bye hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up sitting breathing doing all the things I hate a lot but why now holy shit I just wanna make a trip to the China